I'm a member of the Gainesville Jewish community. I've been here going on 50 years. When I heard that Chabad was coming, I said, incredible. In 2000, all these people started encouraging us to go to University of Florida, to Gainesville. They thought it would be a great place that was really in need of a Chabad house. We had never heard of Gainesville. I don't think then we could have envisioned what would end up happening now. First location was a rental house uh, near Westside Park. From there they went to a little larger house. From there they had a small building here. Just steadily has grown ever since. They've helped the community grow. They've certainly been very successful with the students. Many people say, build it and they shall come. In our case, it was the reverse. They came and we needed the body for the soul. There was such excitement and such interest in activities and programs, services for the community, for the students. It was beyond our wildest imagination how much it would actually be used. That students even sit in the lobby talking till one o'clock in the morning. And every single day, there are students doing laundry or using the gym or using the library and of course the cafe. It's the only option on or off campus right now in Gainesville to get a certified kosher meal. Chabad at UF is the heart of the Jewish Gator Nation, an important part of the University of Florida community, supporting our students, encouraging students of uh, Jewish heritage to, to celebrate their faith, to learn more about their faith. This time that students are at university is typically the most transformational part of their lives. Not all of that is something that you can learn in a classroom. So Rabbi Beryl, Hani, by Aaron, Pessy. They're models that our young students can see living their lives, raising their children, and discovering who they themselves are and what they aspire to be. Here at the Lubavitch Chabad Jewish Student and Community Center at the University of Florida and for Greater Gainesville, our mission is to provide anything in the realm of Jewish life and learning for the students, for the community. We're inspiring people to grow to their potential. When a student shows up here, we think to ourselves, you know, can you imagine how many other places it could, he or she could be, yet they choose to come and celebrate their Judaism, and that's like the most beautiful thing in the world. For many students, this is the first time that they make their own conscious decisions about how they want to include Judaism in their life. And coming to a school that boasts 50,000 people, and for a Jewish student to feel welcome there is very hard. However, having a Chabad, which is beyond vibrant events every single other week, there's Shabbat meals every Friday night. Having that outlet for Jewish students coming in, it's a blessing. There are people that do come and do want to pray and get very involved, but there's also people on the other end that it's more the social aspect, meeting people that you feel comfortable with, can do homework with. It's more how can you find like a family away from home. Having Chabad here has been really amazing. It's been a place where I could just disconnect from the stresses of school during the week and just come to a place where I'm going to enjoy a nice home-cooked meal, be surrounded by other Jewish friends, and I look forward to it every week. The overwhelming number of Jews in the Gainesville area are, of course, students. But Chabad has been a very strong force of bringing community and student activities together. They know the students are definitely the lifeblood here. But they do a great job of just kind of keeping their, their entire audience engaged. Whether it's you know a 13-year-old boy or a 19-year-old college freshman or a 40-ish you know married couple, you'll always have Hanukkah parties for the kids and a thing to bounce house and donkeys and this and the park. He'll dress as you know Mordechai for Hanukkah. He'll do stuff for the kids to make them want to be here too. Everyone is welcome. There's no judgment. It's a place where you come back to Judaism, perhaps, where you find your Judaism that you never had before. I enjoy coming here to Davin to pray. Everybody knows what a wonderful place this is. The first time that I came here, I really felt the warmth. It just really felt very welcomed. I started studying with Beryl. I have to say, it was, a, it was somewhat life-changing and has been a great support to our whole family, including my parents who live here. It's a shining light 
in this community. When I attended Passover Seder, I have indeed seen some of our superstar faculty there with the students, with their families. I know that over the past 18 years, there have been members of the community, alumni, graduates, that have invested back in the programs, back in the facility, which enables a lot to accomplish its goals. Linda and I ourselves are, are, are small donors to Chabad, and, and we, we, we love the fact that we can be a part of the next 18 years. We feel very lucky that from the beginning and throughout the 18 years that we've been here, we've had so much involvement and friendship from the community. From the first Black Bomer, when people came to our barbecue, the local community is almost like our uh, solid rock here in Gainesville. They stay. Students, to be honest, come and go, as we all know. Our friends here in the community from May 2000, in the 18 years, we've been through life cycle events, bar mitzvahs, weddings, shared with their families at their simchas. The local Gainesville community has supported us from day one, and we are forever grateful, and we know that they are here to stay with us. I feel it's really important that we continue to support Chabad because that is how this place continues. You know, it costs so much money for Shabbos dinner for kids. It costs so much money for Passover. And Rabbi will send out great little cards that say how much it all costs and how much you can pay for. We're transparent with our budget. We show all of the costs from the activities and programs. The beautiful facility and building that we have now uh, carries a $2 million mortgage. We have not hesitated to support it. We recognize the needs. Well, you think of College Town, Gainesville, and here you have Chabad. It's just thriving and a wonderful thing in our community. They and their family are God's gift to Gainesville and to the Jewish students who come here and to my family who always feel welcome here. They really value what they do. They bring something to the community that the community would not, and the university would not have otherwise. It's really worthy of support. We're very thankful for them. We, we trust and, and know that they're going to continue to grow and continue to make this a great Jewish community and a wonderful place to not only live but to, to raise a family. In. I'd like to hope that they would continue to grow over the next 18 years in the way they've grown in the first 18 years. We're charged by the Lubavitch Rebbe with a mission to go out there, and in our case, that's to go to Gainesville and to reach and touch every single Jew and make sure that the next 18 years will be above and beyond anything that we've ever imagined. Our work is not anywhere near done. We're going to double and triple our, our efforts to make sure that Jewish students are more engaged, involved, and joy and love being Jewish. We are proud to be Shluchim of the Rebbe, humble to serve. Uh, the university and Gainesville community. Our children are amazing. They're partners. Many of them have impacted families and students more than Khani and I. And as we say in Gainesville, it's, it's great, great to, to be, be a, a Jewish, Jewish Gator. Gator.